Crikey! Good day, mate. I didn't see you there. It's me, Crocodile Joe. Oh, who am I kidding? It's me, everyone. Joe, your local zoologist and tour guide. Now, I normally spend my days at the zoo giving tours to people like you and teaching you all about the awesome animals and wonderful nature that live there. Now, like a lot of you out there, right now I'm having to spend a lot of time at home. But working as a zoologist and tour guide, it's basically impossible for me to do my work from home. And I'm starting to miss all of you and all of the animals at the zoo, and I miss giving people tours. And that is why I am here today. I'm here to bring the zoo to you. That's right, folks. Klein Theater is going to let me take you on a very special virtual tour of the zoo. Now, this is going to put my tour giving skills to the ultimate test. Because you see, here at home, I don't have any of the animals. I don't have any of the cool things that we usually have at the zoo. So I'm going to have to be creative and I'm going to need all of your help. Now, you may be asking yourself, how am I supposed to bring the zoo to you if I don't even have the zoo here? And I don't have any animals or any of the cool stuff that we normally have at the zoo. Well, I'm here to bring you in on a little secret. Shh. 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 <clears throat> we don't need any of that stuff. Mm -mm. You see, being at the zoo is about enjoying the moment and taking in all of the beauty that's around you. Now, we may not have any of the animals that we normally have at the zoo, but we can still keep our spirits high and follow our zoo's motto. Witness the world around you! Like I said, many of us are working from home and spending a lot more time indoors than we usually do. But if you still can go outside, there's still a lot of world to witness. So in order to get this tour started, we need to put on our stuff and head outside. Come on, everybody. Let's head outside and see what we can find. Well, hello everyone and welcome to my backyard. Mm -hmm. Let's see what we can find. Um... Oh, here we have something very special. Would you look at this? It's a tree. Now trees are very important because they give us oxygen. Being a, a zoologist, I don't really know a lot about that, but um, they're pretty special. Now, um, I may not know a lot about how how trees work, but this reminds me of all the birds that we had at the zoo. <laughs> Boy, do I miss those little critters. <laughs> well, um, I guess we should keep this tour moving. <laughs> Let's see what else we can find out here. Oh, would you look at that? It's grass. Would you look at that? Look at it. Now grass may grow all around us, but how often do you really take the time to look at it? It's time for us to get up close and personal with it. Let's look at it. It's so beautiful. You know, looking at this grass reminds me of the giraffes we have at the zoo. They love to eat grass. I love to keep those fellows company at dinner time and watch them eat. And I just, I miss them so much. And I don't know when I'm ever gonna see them again. <laughs> I just can't do this. I know that I'm the best dang tour guide in the whole zoo, but I just can't stay focused. Every time I try and look at all this stuff, I just get distracted and I start to feel anxious. Do you know what it means to feel anxious? Why don't you take a minute to think about that?
you all for taking a minute to think about that. I took that time to calm down, get control of my emotions. Feeling anxious is a little like feeling worried. It's when we get worried because things are uncertain or we don't know what's gonna happen. Now a lot of people are feeling anxious right now because we don't know what's gonna happen or how long this is gonna last or how it's all gonna play out. When we start to feel anxious and worry too much about the future, we miss out on all of the wonderful and beautiful things that are happening around us right now. In order to witness the world around us, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a deep breath in for five seconds and then out for five seconds. Do that with me. Great. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna name three beautiful things that are around me right now that I'm grateful for, okay? First of all, I'm grateful to have this big backyard so that I can be outside at all. Second of all, I'm grateful for all of the warm sunshine that we have today. And third of all, do you hear that? I'm grateful for all of the birds that are making noise outside today. Wow, you know, taking a few seconds to be grateful and recognize things around me has made me feel a little bit better. Why don't you all give that a try now? Alright everyone, thank you for giving that a try. It's time to head back inside. Oh, thank you so much everyone for tuning into this very special virtual tour, and I hope to see you all again real soon. Make sure to tune in for more climb adventures right here on this page. Goodbye everybody!